Hey, that's Mike and Holly, Alex, Eddie, and Chelsea. Playing Mario Kart at Cadillac. <laughs> oh, so mommy's getting her car washed. They got snacks. We got cookies. Snack bar, TV, nice lounge. All for free, kind of. I mean, we paid for the car, so. We are currently in a $90,000 car that is like. Okay, there are screens in the back, TVs. There's screens on the windows for privacy. This car is incredible. I don't know which one this one is. Okay, okay, oh stop, stop, stop. I'm like Chelsea. <laughs> Calm down a little. But yeah, it's, um, it's pretty gorgeous. <laughs> Here we go, Patty Caddy, all Sparkly, all cleaned up. They even do the inside. Woo hoo! It smells so delicious. She smells so delicious, it's Chelsea delicious. says. Mmm. Now we're gonna stink it up with our stinkiness. Just kidding. <laughs> okay, guys, I want to share my excitement over the whole Cadillac thing. <laughs> so sing the praises of Cadillac. So when we bought my car, they told us that we would get complimentary car washes on it. And I and Michael was like, yeah, I saw the car wash thing, you know, when we were buying the car, signing the papers and stuff where they do the detail. So I was thinking, oh, like anytime I want, I could just drive through the car wash. Like I thought it was just going to be like those that they have at the gas station that you just drive through. And I was like, okay, that's cool. Like when I'm in this, in that area or whatever, I can just swing in and get a car wash. And because the thing with my Durango, I never washed it unless it was a drive through car wash. And I just, even then, I just never washed it because I never had the time to even just go to the drive through car wash. Well, I figured it out. If I bring Alex on to class on one of the days I take her to class, I can go get my car washed. So I called them beforehand. I'm like, where do I go? What do I do like to get the car wash? And I thought I was just going to be able to drive through. They're like, no, you bring it to us and you, no, 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 you're going to make it freezing cold in here. What are you doing? And, um, Chelsea's pushing buttons mm -hmm. and I was like, they're like, no, you, you leave it with us. And then you sit in the lounge. They have a lounge and they have fresh baked cookies. Like when you touch the chocolate, it, it's still soft. That's how fresh they are. Granola bars, water, coffee, a TV, comfortable seats. We sat and played the switch. Um, chips, Chelsea got a bag of chips to snack on later. And they're like, it's gonna be about 25 minutes. And I'm like, okay, cool, that's fine. You know, I don't have to wash it myself. <laughs> and at the 25 minute mark, we went in and used the restroom. I think they must have called me when we were in the restroom uh, or they couldn't find me or whatever. So we went and looked at, we were looking at those other fancy cars. The one car that, I, that we were sitting in was it was a ninety thousand dollar car it was incredible and it was the ct6 for anyone who's interested but oh my gosh like they had tv screens built into the seats and like it was just it was crazy cool the shades oh my gosh i would love to have that i would love to have that i'm like looking like i don't have that do i no i don't have that that is a cool feature um but anyway not only do they like wash the outside of your car it's completely spotless nothing on it and it was really dirty it was i've had it a month and it was just it was really bad already um but they vacuum the inside and wipe down the inside as well so i don't have to like that's probably alex buzzing me i don't have to wash my car or vacuum the inside i can't believe it i used to have to vacuum it all the time now i can just go there and they'll do it for me so cool it doesn't cost me anything i mean it doesn't cost me anything i bought the car there but I'm so excited. I don't have to wash my car anymore. I don't have to vacuum it out anymore. How cool is that? That alone is worth having a Cadillac, in my opinion. <laughs> All right, who's ready for a little trivia? I think Michael is definitely ready. Daddy. What's the category? This is the ultimate quiz for you. It is Michigan slang. It's a thing. Do you know these 21 typical Michigan Thing. Question number one, which I know the answer to. 
What's considered the cure for everything, or at least for a stomach ache? Burners. Burners. <laughs> Can we swing by blank on the way home? I need to pick up some groceries. Can we swing by where on the way Party home? Party store? Huh? Party store? Party store. No. Wait, reread that though? Can we swing by where Party on the store? way home? I need to pick up some groceries. Specific? I can give you a selection. Kroger's? Close. <laughs> Ralph's? No. Jewel or no. Myers? Myers. Myers. I knew that one too. All right, next one. Remembering all those Great Lakes is easy if you know the acronym. It's... I don't know the acronym, but I could probably name all of them. <laughs> Shown. I've never heard that. Honed or Homes. H-O-M-E-S, H-O-N-E-D, or S-H-O-N-E. What were you saying? Superior? Lake Michigan. Okay, Lake Michigan. Superior. Well, Lake, then it would be Holmes. Lake Huron, Lake Erie, Lake Ontario. So it's Holmes, H-O-M-E-S. Oh, I've never heard of that. No, you never heard that? Okay, so, but we know that that's the correct answer. When it's time for a Michigander to vacation, where do you go? North. I knew that one. <laughs> I knew that one. Okay, if someone's talking about fudgies, they just mean... Fudge? Fudgies? I've never heard of that. Fudgies? You've never heard of fudgies? Okay, fudge shop workers, summertime tourists, or preschoolers? It's probably got to be the tourists. Tourists? That's, what, that's your heard, guess? Never heard it referred to that. Never heard that before in Fudgy. all your years. It's not always necessary to head to the gym during the winter. You might get a great workout from... Shoveling snow. Okay, starting the fireplace, defrosting your car, or shoveling snow. <laughs> I didn't even need a, a multiple choice for that. Okay, around here, Halloween costumes work best if you can find a way to work in a blank into them. A jacket. Yeah, so a heavy coat. A heavy coat, yeah. Rain boots or umbrella. Yep. Had, well, yeah, those too. <laughs> <laughs> All the above. Quite a few times that you've had to... Go trick-or-treating in the snow. Uh-huh. So we had you know, winter coats, snow boots, gloves. See, it's so funny because here it's either rained, which really doesn't happen that often. It happened a few times when I was a kid, but not much. Or um, once when I was a teenager and we got soaked. It was kind of fun, actually. And the heat, usually it's so stinking hot, we're sweating in our costumes. So for you to grow up in heavy coats and for me to grow up sweating, it's kind of kind of funny. So, okay, any, Michigan, any Michigander will tell you that dodging ridiculously huge blank could be considered an extreme sport. Potholes. I knew that. <laughs> I knew that one. The other choices were speed bumps or curbs. Books might tell you that Michigan State Bird is the American Robin, but you know it's actually the... So it's like a joke. It's not for real. But you know it's actually the wasp, bumblebee, or mosquito. I think I've heard people say mosquito, like yeah. jokingly. It's supposed to be a that joke. I be jokingly anywhere, though. Pasties are... Pasties. Pasties. <laughs> <laughs> pa pa pasties, pasties. Pa pa pasties, pasties, I can't even say it, are, what? Well, they can be a number of things, but they're about yay big, they're like a little pie. A small? They can be either filled with fruits, but a lot of people fill them with like meat and like potato and stuff. You know what the answer is? It says oh. small, delicious meat pies. Also, it's pasties. <laughs> instead of pasties yeah, well, yeah. and then the other choices were cookies and something that you wear we on your body with fruit, like fruit pie stuff, so. okay uh you're either a blank or a blank fan you just cannot be both michigan michigan state yep wolverine spartans <laughs> But you guys can agree that blank is the worst, Ohio the absolute State. worst. Ohio. Yeah. Ohio State. I knew that one too. I knew both of those. It's kind of like nails on a chalkboard when you hear someone pronounce it. Mackinac, Mackinac, or Mackinac? Mac Mackinac. Or Mackinac. Mackinac well, is the right way to say everybody it. Everybody say, says Mackinac, but Mackinac, I think, is also technically correct so which one would be nails on a chalkboard mackinac right i would right? probably say people mackinac because everybody says mackinac 
Yeah, I would, I would think so too, because I learned that a long time ago. Where does Michigan fall on the whole pop soda debate? <laughs> It's always going to be soda. Neither we say cola or we call it pop. It is, it is, to end all wars, it is pop. It was first created to be pop. Not soda, not <laughs> Coke. It's okay. Because the, the, the bubbles popped. What on earth is a youper? That's anybody who lives in the Upper Peninsula. Correct. You said it word for word. Anyone who lives in the Upper Peninsula, someone who... Someone whooping it up at a Wolverines game, or that's what we call tourists. <laughs> Anyone in the UP? Okay, so if you don't live in the UP, that means you live beneath the Mackinac Bridge, making you a... Troll. So it was Grohl, Tremlin, or Hobbit. Okay, blank. Uh, it's not a sliding door, it's a blank. It's a Michigan thing. Not a sliding door. What do they call sliding doors? Uh, Let me know when you give yeah, up. give me multiple. Door slide. Wall slide. Or door wall. I think it was the first one, but no, we don't. Nobody says that. door slide. You think it's door slide? Final answer. It's a sliding door. I know, but what do they call it? I don't think that's right. Door slide, <laughs> wall slide, or door wall. I don't know. Which one? You have to pick one, so I know if you get a hundred percent or not. A. A. Okay. Let's play. U Ucher. Euchre. Euchre. I even brought blank with me. Chips. Dice, cards, or paddles? Dice. Dice. Okay. Oh, well, no cards. I don't know. Oh, no. I clicked dice. Uh, oh, it's okay. Okay. <laughs> you might not get 100. On Fridays, we spaghetti shindig, pizza party, or fish fry? Fish fry. I don't know. <laughs> That's a complete I've never heard of that. You can practically consider which of these days a state holiday. First day of deer hunting season, national ice cream day, or last day of duck hunting season? Deer hunting. I figured that too. Yep. You're so lucky to call the blank state home. There's seriously nowhere else quite like Michigan. Show me state, Great Lake, or cheese state? Great Lake? Yeah, that's a weird one, isn't it? Calculating results. Let's see what you got. 100%. And you're there's a... like two I for sure 100% guessed. Oh, you're a Michigander, all right, yep. it says. <laughs> and I would say like I probably knew about... 80% of them? Okay, some of those of aren't them? Michigander things. The they door are probably one. a very select, this big of the population, that refers to it that way. Ed? Mommy's talking to you. He's ignoring me because he knows he's in trouble. What did you do? What did you do? What? <laughs> he's like, I don't <laughs> he went right for it. No, no, no. Come, look at this. Look at it. Look at this. Well, but Shame. that's... No, up, 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 up. He don't know it's not his though. Why? He assumes it's a hula hoop. That's mine, it's right? Okay, for those who don't remember, at the old house we used to get him these. They're from the Dollar Tree, so they're only a dollar. But these plastic hula hoops. And he would tear them up. He would go nuts and he'd flip them all around and then eventually... Ah, oh, the good old days. Eventually he'd snap them and bust them all up. Well, I told Chelsea today she wanted to play with her hula hoop and I said, you got to keep it away from Ed or he'll want to chew it up. He thinks it's his toy. If, you know, if it gets near him. Sure enough. She was like, well, he... Uh, I don't remember what she said. He came over to me and I... Blah, 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 and he took off with it. He snatched it, and he took off with it, and he chewed it up. It's not bad, but it's all... It probably doesn't hula anymore. It just hoops. <laughs> it doesn't. No, I think it's fine. It's just got some dents in it, but I was like... She was mad, and I was like, hey, I told you. He's I like, warned waiting. you. 